is Idris. So today we will be reading some verses from the Quran in Surah Al Kahf, inshallah. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim Alhamdulillahi al-lazhi anzal ala abdihi al-kitab wa lam yaj'al lahu iwaja qayyiman liyundir baksan shadidan ويبشر المؤمنين الذين يعملون الصالحات أن لهم أجرا حسنا ما كثين فيه أبدا وينذر الذين قالوا اتخذ الله ولدا ما لهم به من علم ولا لآبا كبرت كلمة تخرج من أفواههم إن يقولون إلا كذبا فلعلك باخع نفسك على آثارهم إن لم يؤمنوا بهذا الحديث أسفا إنا جعلنا ما على الأرض زينة لها لنبلوهم أيهم أحسن وعملا وإنا جاعلين ما عليها صعيدا جرزا أم حسبت, أم حسبت أن أصحاب الكهف والرقيم كانوا من آياتنا عجبا صدق الله العظيم <تصفيق> الحمد لله رب العالمين um, also after also reading the Quran I would like to add another hadith or two um, based on what we read the benefit of reading this surah surah al-kahf because tomorrow is Friday so the benefit of reading surah al-kahf on a Friday is Prophet said, Peace be upon him, said, Whoever reads Surah Al Kahf on a Friday, he's, um, he will be enlightened until the next week, until the next Friday. And also, in the narration, he said, Whoever reads Surah Al Kahf, now just reading it, understanding the verses, you know, understanding the verses and believing in those verses. He will be protected from Masih Dajjal and I think most of us know his story. So let's do our best and uh, read these words. So it will come on a Friday, inshallah. And let's try to understand those verses and believe in.